ED paint plant today. Our local assembly operation has been in existing here in Mombasa Road for the last 45 years at this plant. As Madam Ritter said, the investment in the ED plant has increased our production capacities for more than 60% per year. In 2017, Isuzu Motors Japan acquired 57.7% shareholding in its company from General Motors Corporation US because of the great confidence in the high growth potential in these regions. Isuzu Motors came into the business with three major areas of commitment. So to deepen manufacturing excellence, build technical expertise and the capacities, and expand after sales services. Isuzu East Africa has since 2017 became a training hub for Isuzu Motor International University Dubai for Sub-Saharan Africans. We have implemented overseas training programs for local team members to improve their skills and assure qualities. Under after-sales businesses, we have increased our customer touch point from 26 outlet in 2017 to 58 outlet in nationwide. We have strengthened communication with our source brand by increasing information exchange between ISU Japan and the Kenyan teams. Your Excellency, Kenya is an important market with a great potential in Africa. My vision is to see ISU East Africa grow to be a manufacturing hub for the ESC so that it will become a wonderful example for neighboring countries. Our increased assembly capacities from the ED paint plant will help us meet the transportation demand from regional market and support Kenyan aspirations of becoming a significant player in African continental free trade areas. Isuzu East Africa is keen to develop our local content suppliers by working with them to meet international standards and support our product quality objectives. Our commitment to manufacturing excellence, therefore, aligns well with the government's vision of a strong industry base and a sustainable economic growth. I invite all our guests to visit the, and take a tour of the East Africa plant to see first hand the state of the art technologies that we have invested in. Let me take these opportunities to thank you, ISU East Africa engineers, who worked hard around the clock to ensure the success of the E-Plan pain. I also wish to express my deepest gratitude to ISU Motors Japan and our local shareholders, the Kenyan Development 